For this Breast Cancer Awareness Month, we've brought you stories on screenings and treatments, but we haven't talked about getting on with day-to-day -day stuff like exercise after surgery until now. Keep in mind, every patient's different. This story is meant to serve as a template for conversation with your doctor. Exercise routines can go out the window when a doctor tells you you have breast cancer. If you have a mastectomy and then rebuild with your own tissue or implants, it's gonna sideline you. But Mary Cleespies had exercise goals. She removed her breasts because of a cancer gene and then opted for implants. The best thing for me was to get, to get back as quickly as possible because Working out makes you strong, but it makes you mentally powerful. I think that's important too. I think exercise is important for you know people recovering. I think they're going to feel better quicker. Dr. Mike Columbus, who does breast reconstruction procedures like this, wants patients to get walking right away, but advises to proceed carefully with other drills. He joined us at It's Working Out. Just have a nice loose grip on your handles so that put most of the work into your lower body. To run through a range of exercises and when those would be appropriate, you're looking at a simple squat. This is legs, calf, butt, you know, you probably can do these things, I would say three to four weeks, you're gonna probably feel comfortable enough to do this kind of stuff. Longer if the surgery is more complex. So extend your arms and then pull straight back. His advice for something like a row or push-up, have patience with anything that engages the core and upper body. Some exercises might have to wait six to eight weeks. You just don't want them to do anything that's gonna, you know, again, potentially tear, bleed, they're back in surgery. With weights, Dr. Columbus says if you go low in the five to 10 pound range, you can start two to three weeks after surgery, but only if that's comfortable. And if you just want to focus on maintaining range of motion, go weightless. You can work on that range even while you're watching TV. Take your hand and put it on top of your head and then reach over and touch your ear. Mary worked with the doctor after her surgery. What Dr. Columbus that is really important. You have to listen to your body. Two weeks out, she was on a stationary bike. Between four and six weeks out, she was back at the gym. Keeping in mind, she ran her list of exercises by the doctor. That was part of my life. I mean, it's really important to me. Physical activity has always been important to me. It makes you, you. And she said, yeah, it makes her you. And getting back to feeling like yourself, is half the battle. Again, you need to talk to your doctor whose advice could vary depending on the reconstruction procedure. Chemotherapy and radiation certainly would impact exercise protocols too.